Hark now hear the Ipswich sing as Norwich run away. And we all fight forevermore because of Boxing Day. Hark now hear the Ipswich sing as Norwich run away. Yo, what's going on guys? Welcome back to episode 6 now and today we take on Norwich in the East Anglian Derby. Of course, we beat Norwich 2-0 at Portman Road earlier in the season and most recently we played Manchester United 2-0 in episode 5. In between uh, these episodes, we played episode, uh, we played, we played Everton 1-1, Everton of course, bottom of the league. We, um, it was a very, very disappointing performance. Although we dominated the game, as far as everything goes, Everton did take the lead on 74 minutes, but Dazelle off the bench got an equaliser in the end, so that was good. Sorry for the squeaky chair, by the way. This is a new chair, it's already squeaky. I'm, uh, I'm six foot seven, I weigh like 22 stone. So yeah, I'm a, I'm a big bloke, and yeah, the chairs are already squeaky, it's horrific. I don't think there's actually any chairs that are built for a big bloke like myself, which is frustrating. But anyway, we play Norwich today, so let's get stuck into it. Actually, no, 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 no. Before we get stuck into it, we have got the uh, recent youth intake to go through. Um, if we go to under 18s, some guy called Kamini Walker, left midfielder, three and a half star potential, looks okay. Nothing really to, to really shout about. I mean, good teamwork, good work rate. Right? I love that about him. Um, a left winger, left only foot though, so he's more likely to be retrained as a, a right inside forward or a maybe hmm, good, not bad finishing, maybe like a striker, maybe. He is on the shorter side, which isn't something I normally go for if I'm a manager. But the one player I want to show you is a player that we got through this youth intake called Gavin Clark, a centre midfielder or a striker, preferably midfielder. Look at those stats, brilliant. That's a brilliant first um, youth player we've got for our intake. Five star potential ability, 17 determination, 15 teamwork, 14 first touch, immediate describe as a promising midfielder, left foot, five foot 11. He's a. Uh, his favourite or preferred role is deep line playmaker, which fits my tactic, which is fantastic. Kev has a striker as well, but he's not overly familiar with us striker roles. However, I think I will be using him as a midfielder. Gavin Clark is on the bench for today. Could come on for his debut. I think I probably will bring him on. If the game's going well, I might give him 20 minutes. Just a slight tactical tweak to today. We're going to remove work ball into the box. I think it's making things a bit complicated for us on the attack, which is why we couldn't put the ball in the back of the net against, the the net against Everton. So removing this little um, this little instruction might just help us get a few more attempts on goal. So we start in goal with Freddie Woodman. In defence, we have Empus, Davies, Watmore and Castagni with Hurley Kane in defence midfield. Dazelle and Lamar make up the centre midfield. Diaz attack midfield. Falami and Pelegri up front. Norwich start goal with Linda. Along the back five, they have Kone, Hanley, Zim Zimmerman, Godfrey and Shalotto. Midfield, they have Ward Prowse and Lena. Up front, they have Watkins, Mitrovic and Stanislas. Stanislas. So first highlight, 30 seconds in, here we go. Castagne to Diaz. Diaz rushing forward as the shadow striker today. Can he make an impression in that new role? Ward Prowse clears. And as far as Herbie Kane, back into Lamer. Lamer out wide to Castagne. Can we get an early goal here? Castagne pulls it in. Blocked out by Kone. Castagne still in position now. Back to Herbie Kane. Herbie Kane back to Castagne. Back to Kane. Dazelle on the edge. Dazelle on his left foot. Gives to Lamer. Empress comes in. Linda saves. Pushed out for a corner. Wow, what a good start this is. Are we going to absolutely. I want to batter Norwich today. I want to absolutely batter him. Dezel with a corner near post, cleared out cleared by Hanley. Herbie Kane on the edge, back out wide to the Zell, back to Kane on the edge. Kane with a shot out wide, Woo -hoo! just over the bar. It stays nil nil. Come on, you blues. Always shit on the old yellow and green. Do 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 Nil nil Norwich are oh, they are really walking off the ice right now. Big goal kick by Linda. Mitrovic heads on. Leighton is chasing it. Davies can he make it back though? Leighton. Oh my goodness. Norwich score on the counter attack. He runs over to the Norwich fans. Look at all that yellow and green. I absolutely hate the look of it. God, it's, it's not even just Norwich, it's just the colour. The yellow and green is such a disgusting colour. Oh my god, 1-0 down to Norwich. Oh, this is not going good. Oh dear, what more the throw in? Castagni. 
tries to find the middle, uh, Curry Kane in the middle, but no, he's going to back, and they almost score a second. Woodman saves. Well, that has really deflated my mood. I thought we were going to be on for a smashing today. Linda now the goal kick. Still a plenty of time left, of course. Big goal kick. Mitrovic doesn't win ahead of this time. Davies does. Kone. Kone comes down the left out wide to Watkins. Watkins has got three players on him. Back to Kone. Good, good pressing by Ipswich. Leighton now in the middle to Ward Prowse. Ward Prowse. Tries to play ball back. Flamy intercepts. Now to Pellegri. Back to Flamy. Flamy running away. He's got support. Diaz on the right. It's a shadow striker. Diaz has got Pellegri and Flamy way in the middle. Can Stagny now. Out wide on the edge to Kane. Shoots. Block. Shoots again. 1-1. One, one. Kill on. Herbie Kane, fifth goal of the season. I tell you what, guys, Herbie Kane, what a signing this guy has been. What, £500,000 I think I spent on him in the first season from Liverpool? If you're uh, if you're playing the Championship or you know, lower reputation, get Herbie Kane. He's a fantastic player, guys. Half time and it is 1 1. Herbie Kane having a 1 2 with the Norwich defender for smashing in the top corner. We have got two yellow cards we want to just get to a stupid quickly do a team talk. Um, we will just calmly say for the fans, calmly for the fans, and then passionately have faith. We'll do calmly have faith, actually. I don't think it makes a whole lot of difference, to be honest. Right, M20 team talk tactics. Lama will just take our, put on these off tackles. And we'll also do Empress on these off tackles. He's on yellow card as well. Diaz, 6.4. Not really doing it for me. Trek Risa, do I try that? Um, check the reason not great in the tap of the field or centre forward positions or similar to advanced playmaker in that he aims to drop into holes between the opposition and field and defence. The trekker reset does far less defence when drifts around looking for space when the team is not in possession. As such, the rest of the team needs to carry him when defending. Hmm. Enganch. I've never used Enganch before actually. Enganch is the size prime creator. I hope that joins with field and attack. Not great. So I'm going to give that one a go actually. I've never, I've never used Enganch before. So um, we'll see how that goes as the others haven't worked so far. Let's start the second half. Well, we are 10 minutes from the end of the game. Still 1-1. One, one. We've also got a stagnant yellow card. We're going to put him on ease of tackles. We're also going to change uh, Empis and Kasagan to a complete win back attack. We're going to sort of throw the kitchen sink out of here. There we came. We're going to put on support just to give a bit more going forward. It's going to leave the defence quite short and leave us vulnerable to any counter-attacks, but... We can't, we can't let Norwich do this to us. Um, uh, Diaz, 6.6, .6, still not really playing very well. We have got Dezel. We're going to bring Dezel on for attacking the field. He's done there well recently when he got off the bench and scored the equaliser. Nydan will come on as a deep line playmaker. He's also been playing well. Um, I really want to bring Gavin Clark on. What a, what a way to come on, but I think that's a bit too much. 6.2 Empis. We're going to give Kenlock a bit of time here. Um, one more one last sub as well. Herbie we Kane 8.3. <clears throat> We're going to leave him on. Ben Flamy 6.5 has not done well. What more 6.1. Mm. That's going to be all our changes for this. Do I make too much? Passionately, I'm looking for you to make a difference. Come on, boys. 10 minutes left. We have got to do this. Just demand more. Last shot of the game. Can we do it? Come on. Five minutes left. Very attacking. Come on, boys. Don't want to drop points on Norwich. I, on, I honestly, I thought we were going to batter these today. Extra time. Norwich looks like the highlight. Mitrovic inside to Hernandez. Hernandez to Miguel. Miguel to Leighton. Those on the other card. Back up wide to Miguel. Miguel tackled and cleared by Ipswich. Pellegri the ball now. Can this be the, the winning goal? Pellegri run forward. Flamis trying to catch up. Pellegri's going alone though. Left foot shot. Straight into the hands of Linda. And it stays 1 1. Ball now in town's half. Norwich with the throne on the right hand side. It will be taken by Shalotto. Shalotto. Three options. Finds Oliveira back to Shalotto. Shalotto can he put the ball in the box? He's got Kenlock on him. Kenlock goes in but misses Mitrovic to Oliveira. Tackled Mitrovic though. Oh, Nidan tackled off as a penalty. Clear by Nidan. Looks like it's going to finish 1 1. Two draws on the trot now against the bottom two sides in the league. And just when I've been talking about how great this tactic's been working. That's all going to pot now. Full-time whistle blows. It ends 1-1 at Carroll Road. 24 shots against their eight. Look, 57% possession. Eight on target, though, is a concern. Oh, lip switch. Dear, oh, dear. I mean, I, want, I thought we were going to absolutely batter them. 
I mean, that was a great start to the game. You just couldn't put the ball in the back of the net. <clears throat> I did, I did uh, use um, chance creation, chance conversion for training on the week prior to this game for the build-up. And also, obviously, uh, attacking movement for match preparation. But it's obviously not had no effect. Um, maybe it's just a little bit of still getting used to the tactic. Who knows? But we drew 1-1. One, one. That does leave us in 10th place in the Premiership with eight games remaining. We're on 39 points, four points outside of the Europa League spot. The top six looks all, all but done. This is going to be a, I mean, look, seven points between sixth and top. That's going to be a hell of a race for the end of the season. Norwich are 10 points stuck, in, 10 points in the relegation zone. So I think we can expect them to be going down this year, which is brilliant. We're going to be back for the next game. Well, we ain't got to schedule it. Let's quickly run forward to the schedule. Don't be too hard on the team after that. It's a tough result to take. Um, yeah, um, we weren't good enough. To, for my eyes, we weren't good enough. I'm going to say it. They look fired up. We should have We should have been beating them to that. Absolutely battering them. All right, schedule. So, look, Wolves next. Then we've got Arsenal. We've got Brighton her 15th and Chelsea her 5th. Then Watford. Burnley and Stoke. I think we're, we're going to come back to the Brighton game, guys. We're going to play Wolves and Arsenal off camera, and then we'll be back for the Brighton game. We haven't we haven't played Arsenal. We're, we played Chelsea yet? I think we have actually. Oh, that's interesting. Let's have a look at my bit of paper with my old episodes on. No, we haven't done Chelsea. We'll tell. We'll come back for Chelsea game actually. That would be a good one to do. We'll come back for Chelsea. And then we'll probably come back for Stoke after that. So we'll do Wolves, Arsenal, and Brighton off camera. And we'll see you guys for the home game against Chelsea. We're currently fifth place. Come on, guys. Come on.